Hello guys, welcome to today's video tutorial by Trust Stanley at TS Tech Talk. Today guys, we are going to be reviewing the difference between the Facebook app and the Facebook page while making use of them to manage your Facebook page, which either of them will be best for you. So um, initially I was making a lot of video about the Facebook application. So I made use of the Facebook app to manage the Facebook page and I did a lot of stuff on the page. But there are some things that you can do on the Facebook app that you'll be able to do easily on your Facebook page. So I'm going to be showing you guys the differences between the Facebook app and the Facebook page and the reason why you'll be making use of the Facebook page and the reason why it will be more effective and more easier for you to manage your Facebook page on the Facebook page on the Facebook page manager. So let's go ahead and dive in. And the reason why I'm showing the two screen is because I want to be showing you one sample on the other screen and then another sample on the other screen. So let's go ahead and dive into that. I'm going to open Facebook manager right here while I open Facebook app right here. So um, it just opened my page because I was currently logged into the page. Usually when you open your app, it displays this option. But when you open your page, it displays this option for you. And uh, now if you want to open your page, you have to click on your pages and then select that particular page. Now, this is how our page look like on the Facebook app. And this is how our page look like on our Facebook page manager. So you can easily notice that on top of the page, you can easily navigate through the other pages right by clicking on the top arrow there that displayed here. But if you want to do that on the Facebook pages, you can just click on the icon and it displays all the pages still easy right then let's continue so um after that you can notice it has more buttons on the top that has overview ads inbox notification more the buttons are cool right and actually easy to manage right not bad but then if you look at the facebook page it doesn't have any of this button on top of it which is actually clean because it's actually focusing on the page next um you can notice how it um the facebook app displays more info for you to follow it actually dif displays different information you can notice where it says keep in touch with your customers and because of the pandemic and all this kind of stuff it always shows those tips depending on a particular trending or a particular thing missing in my channel it shows a lot of those kind of stuff so um that's that for the um facebook app then if you notice below it has my name still normal thumbnail and then follows then let's look at the bottom that displays next after the following so for the facebook app it has the edit page it has the view as it has the post option and then it also have the photo option and then for the facebook page it only has post um photo events and then promote the reason why it's um displaying this way is because the facebook app is more focused on your page so facebook app actually does show like this is an application and it's only built for you to manage your page so that's why it looks a bit different from the facebook app and then if you notice um after that it still has more of these other features that shows you home live video events shops photos and more but it doesn't display that right here for us you can notice while i'm scrolling down it doesn't display all those options that are displaying right here from your facebook app but another interesting thing is this one that shows on the bottom of the of the facebook page area it displays the facebook page which is itself then the next is actually the insight and then the next is the message icon and then notification icon and then it displays your um appointment icon and then the jobs icon so most of all these tools i've actually made use of them on the previous tutorials on the facebook app but i'm still going to be showing you guys how to do that on your facebook page manager so let me go ahead and click some of these so that you guys can see you can notice it displays insight and then to go about displaying insight on this particular area we have to go a long way by clicking on the more session and clicking on the inside. It actually displayed in a different way, nothing much different. It still displays the same thing. So, but the only difference is just the way to navigate and easily get to that particular application. And I think it actually showing a different option because this one shows 
my feeds for seven days while this one shows my analytics for eight days. So um, the next um, tool we have here, it's the inbox icon. The inbox icon actually shows the recent message and the comment section. You can notice the comment section right next to it, right? But while um, getting to that on our, on our Facebook application, we have to go back and then click on messages. Although there are still other ways to get to that, you can notice it only displays messages right here and it doesn't have any other option to click or to navigate to comments. While I can easily do that right here, I can go to comment and go to messages easily, right? So um, the next button is this button for notifications. And then this button is also available for you right here, notifications below so click on that and you can notice it's still the same notification but a little bit different from what i got from the other end because it's showing more more visible and more detailed than the facebook app i don't know if you guys are actually catching this but i think i find a lot of interest in the facebook app more so let's click on the next one which is the appointment option you can notice i can easily add an appointment right there and you can still see that the appointment is still displaying here so still the same visual and the same ui effects very cool right but the thing is the apps are actually the facebook page manager actually made things look a bit more easier and you can notice the job section if i say select it they all this display the same way but the thing is just for you to actually get to it and I'm still looking for the job okay yeah there you go so but this only have managed job so if i want to create a new job you can see the setting right on top of this area while this one actually displays everything about job for you can see advertise your job appointment contact events so whichever it is you can just select on the job and then if you want to post a job same thing so um hopefully um, when you click on the main area too, you can notice the different way the navigation is displaying, right? It's actually displaying in a different pattern. Then this one is actually displaying the same, exactly the way I arranged it to display on the desktop and also for other users. But while this one is not displaying that exactly those things, this is actually showing me my video because it's actually assuming I am the owner of this channel. So it doesn't need to set it to look like a visitor to the channel. So it looks pretty great and looks pretty easy to use and you can easily navigate and without a stress so i would do recommend you guys to actually maintain if you have enough space on your phone because the reason why i made several of the videos about the facebook app is because some people were asking question and trying to learn how to manage their facebook page with their facebook app without making use of several application and downloading several facebook apps because of um storage issues on their phone so um but if you guys are actually interested in making your Facebook page look good and look better, I would advise you to get a Facebook page manager. And there are other tools that are accompanying this. You can also get a Facebook ad manager, different tools that you can make use of. But um, right now, download a Facebook page manager to manage your page. If you are running an advert, download an ads manager to manage your advert and to run advert easily for Facebook. So, um, from the next chapters i'm going to be showing you guys how to make use of your facebook page manager and this is actually very very easy to use so if you guys are finding this any difficult please leave a comment below and if you enjoyed the video please subscribe to the channel share the video with your friends and smash the like button for me all right stay home and stay safe on my next video i'm going to be showing you guys more tips of how to manage the facebook page Alright, peace.